6. DHS is getting a babysitter. This after failing to drastically improve its foster care system as required by law. It's new information that 2 News investigator Marla Carter uncovered since her last report one month ago. Marla? Karen, the 2 News investigators examined the new order and outlined 10 changes. Giving a voice to thousands of children in the state's foster care. That was the idea behind a federal lawsuit filed in 2008. The suit alleged high caseload and a shortage of foster care homes put children at risk of harm. The judge agreed and ordered DHS to make big changes. A group of three state appointed people called co-neutrals are supposed to make sure that those changes happen. Fast forward to today, the co-neutrals say DHS is falling short of meeting its goals. Fred Dorward represents the plaintiffs. There was no evidence that the state was proceeding in good faith. So now the co-neutrals have ordered DHS to provide weekly reports showing that it's improving caseload. And in two months, DHS must give the co-neutrals a plan showing how the agency will meet goals to get more foster care homes. And it's just a reflection of the fact that DHS hasn't taken management responsibility. But DHS says it is trying and has seen a 40% increase in children coming into foster homes and that's provided an additional challenge. A DHS spokesperson sent us this statement about the new demands, saying, in part, DHS will work to implement these specific processes, which we also believe will be helpful in our efforts. Now you can read the entire DHS statement along with the order on our website, kgrh.com. Reporting live from your downtown Tulsa, Marla Carter, 2 Works for you.